Hey y'all! Good morning, good morning! I am back with a Lola haul, like I promised. So, I shared my love of Pandora with y'all last week, and I promised I would be back when I got this package. Let's see how big it is. It's pretty big. Um, and I will share what I got. So, Rulala has Pandora, more like retired pieces than current things um, at a good discount. Like most of these are like half off. So I got a couple and by couple, I mean like seven. <laughs> so I also got two leather bracelets. I'm gonna open them up because apparently they're in these little like sealed wrap packages. So let's open them so we can look at them. And maybe I need scissors. Don't, they kind of have this little slit at the top, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to get in that way. All right, I'm going to open them with some scissors. That's better. So I've never had one of their leather ones before. They are nice. I like the clasp. I mean, it's just like the normal Pandora clasp, like on my regular bracelet. Not the barrel, but the um, just the round one. These are double bracelets, so they're supposed to wind around your wrist twice. Let's see how they fit. They only had one size in the silver, so obviously that's the size I got. And hopefully it fits. I think it's gonna fit just fine. Yeah, I like it. It's still, I mean, it's gonna take a while to be bendy, obviously. Okay, and it really does not wanna participate because it's just not bendy yet. There we go. So. You can still fit two fingers under it or a thumb, which is the recommended amount by Pandora. My husband, of course, picked out my original bracelet and he just guesstimated on the size and I can fit like all kinds of stuff under here. It's very loose, which is okay with me because like, I don't know, I don't care. I'm used to wearing it now. I've been wearing it for like four years, so I do like the leather. Um, both of the bracelets that I got, the Honeysuckle and the Silver, are from the same release back in 14, 15, I don't remember. Um, and they don't have the threads, which is the only reason I wasn't 100% sure whether I wanted these or not. But they were $25 instead of 50 So I'll just put clips on the end it, ends and that'll be fine. They say you can't put as many beads on the leather ones. Um, so we'll see how that works. They say like where I have, you're supposed to be able to fit 15 on a full Pandora bracelet. I have 20 and I'm going to put uh, a couple more on here before I'm done. They say you can put seven to nine on the leather. So let's open some of these. So I got two of the Moranos in the blush and they're the faceted and I have never been a big fan of Murano's, but I thought these were so pretty. They're definitely um, darker than I thought they would be, but that might just be because my room's really dark today. Like out in the light, they may be sparklier, but you can see them. Oh, see, that looks pretty against the blue bead there. I like the faceted beads. So I got two of those so that they can match on my my new bracelet that I want to start after I'm done with this one is going to be blush and rose gold. So I, I don't really know what I'm going to do with these. So I just got them because they were on sale and I kind of have been wanting these colors. I may do something with them one day. I may not. You know, 
I think I might just wear them as leather for now. And then I got, oh, the swan. Look how pretty that is. I love it. This one is retired. And I got her for 29 Normally she's 70 so I'm very happy with that. And then I got the little galaxy. This is so cute. Oh, I didn't realize the star was fixed. I thought it was like a dingley, but that's still really cute. I do like that it's fixed in place. So the celestial line, let me um, show you guys in my Pandora book. We have celestial line in here and it is gorgeous blue and silver enamel and I just think it is so pretty it's not anything I normally go for but I've loved it for the last like I think it came out last year for the last year I've wanted it and there's just a couple beads in this collection that I think are so pretty and then it um it has the button beads that have the snowflakes on them that go perfectly. Of course, I don't know where exactly in this book they are. I can't find them, I won't worry about it. Like, look at that. That blue and white enamel, that is so pretty. I thought it was in with like Christmas, but who knows. Anyways, I think on this silver bracelet, eventually I'm going to put the blue and white ones. There's four, maybe five ones that I want. This is one of them. And mainly that main dangle bead that I showed you, this one. On the back, it says, I love you to the moon and back. And that just really resonates with me because of my husband. So that's why I want those couple. The swan, I am just obsessed with swans this year. Like, um, if you look at my planner, I have swans all over it. See my little swans? They're so pretty. And then I have, um, let's see if I can find them. Maybe, I just saw them, so of course now I'm not going to be there. I just have swans all over it. I love them this year. They're my new. They're my new obsession. I've been a fox girl for a couple years, and now I'm like, no, swan everything. So that's why I got that little swan. And the last but not least, I don't know what this little black thing in here is. It is it's just a piece of paper. Okay, whatever. Don't. don't wrapped in tissue paper because it's super special oh it's so delicate I had no idea my rose gold bow that is so pretty I can't wait so I am going to put some of them on my little just had my scissors you guys like if I had a brain I would be dangerous there they are I'm just gonna put them on the honeysuckle bracelet for now um, so that they're not all over the place I'm gonna eventually like I said get a rose gold bracelet but I guess I could leave them in their little bags but I think I like them better on here and I want to see how they fit so this guy can be in the middle, and then the swan, and then the bead, and then dun, 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 the other Milano. I'm not even doing this on camera very well. And then I'm going to get out my crowning jewel. In the new collection that I got yesterday. I'm going to do a post review on it, so I'm not going to worry about it during rule of law haul time. The snail. Oh, it's so pretty. Right there. See, that's not a bad start to a little bracelet. 
The snail is my brother charm. My brother is always joking about snails and his video games, and by always I mean like twice, but since my husband has passed, my brother has just been my rock. He's always taking care of me, and so this just represents how much he has really been there for me in probably the hardest time of my life. I hope the hardest time of my life because I cannot go through this again, y'all. So, obviously this will look better on a rose gold bracelet, but for now, there's my little Rula Lafa. And I think it's pretty darn cute. Alright, well, thanks for watching, y'all. Um, I did put the link for Rulala in the description box. So if you haven't heard of them or you haven't checked them out, totally go check them out because they're definitely worth it. Like, like I said, most of these were like 50% off. I got both bracelets. One, two, three, four, five charms for 200 bucks including shipping and honestly like if I were to buy these new from the store I added it up and they would have been over $400 so I mean that's more than 50% off I am very happy plus I really wanted this one this one was why I looked found rule a lot in the first place um, I was looking for it and I found that they were selling it and they did a bunch of research on them and found that they do have good rule of law um authentic pandora charms that they are an authorized retailer so i am obsessed i love this bow way more than i thought i would i'm so glad i got it i was on the fence about this one I was like do i really need it yes i really need it so thanks for watching y'all i can't wait to show you guys the rose gold bracelet um i'm gonna get that next week and then my, because they're having a sale, a spend more, save more sale. I think that's like spend 150, save 50. Spend 350, save 125. Spend 600, save 225. And spend 1,000, save 400. Some of those numbers may be off because I don't have them memorized, but I think that's it go look it up on their website. Either way, I'm not spending a thousand dollars on jewelry, especially because I just got this haul um, and the snail. I had to have them. I went out and got them. Um, you had to get two beads from the new Enchanted line and I wanted the snail in the teapot, but they didn't have the teapot and we drove all the way to the store, which is a couple hours away. So she let me just get the one and then if you were got two of the new beads, you got a freebie and I had wanted this little heart because my husband got me the interlocking hearts and said that they were he and I he got them not for Christmas not for Valentine's Day just for a day that I was having a really hard day and he took me he said we're going out and we went to a movie and afterwards we went to Pandora and he just picked this out and bought it for me and it's really special to me. So, um, I have my bracelet on upside down. Perfect. I'm going to have to fix that. <laughs> and so it's very special to me. And so I wanted the interlocking hearts. And when I saw that was one of the free ones, I went ballistic. So we went and got it. It's actually supposed to be the rose gold hearts, but um, the store that I went to doesn't sell rose gold, and so she made an exception to let me get the silver ones, and you're supposed to have a scratch-off card, and she was just really, really sweet and helpful. So if you ever need to go buy Pandora Charms, go to Glow and Troy, Alabama, and they will help you, and they were awesome. And yeah, so I will share... Um, what I get at the sale next week, and then I will be on a self-imposed Pandora ban for like six months or a year or two years because I've bought way too much recently, and um, I need to stop 
madness. <laughs> but I just really wanted to finish my bracelet. And these were just too good of a deal to pass up with Rulala. So, all right. Bye, y'all.